Welcome back, everybody. Now a Fox 35 exclusive. 1,700 jobs saved at a time when a lot of people are still out of work. It's great news. Fox 35's Lara Greenberg has the story you'll see only on Fox 35 News. It's crazy. March 16th, we closed all our restaurants down and didn't know what was going on or how long it would last. Eric Holm is the country's largest Golden Corral franchisee, a self-made millionaire who owned 33 locations in Florida and Georgia. But last year, they all closed. I didn't know because they had no warning. Just one day I drove over here and it was closed. By October, five had reopened and home filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy. Chapter 11, yeah, let us reorganize our finances, gave us some breathing room which we needed. Today, Home officially emerged from bankruptcy and is about to reopen his 22nd Golden Corral location. 11 of the original 33 will remain permanently closed. More than 1,600 people have gotten their jobs back here. Thank you, man. Have a good day. And he hopes to increase that to 2,000 employees total when all is said and done. That's our proudest moment is being able to employ all these folks and they wanted to come back to work. At the beginning of the pandemic, people thought that buffets might be dead. But clearly, business is back. Savings and PPP money allowed home to spruce up the 22 locations with fresh paint, landscaping, furniture, and glove stations. He says it's diehard fans like Gary Langston who helped keep the lights on. When they started opening back up, we, were, we would drive to Lakeland one day, they opened first. We drive to Eustis another day. We go to villages some days. And wherever one was open, that's where we went. It was a dark period of time, so we had to get out of the darkness and and make our own light. A golden light, if you will. In Altamont Springs, Lyra Greenberg, Fox 35 News.